Hello class, Mr. Neidegger here on Tuesday, May 26th. Woke, woke up this morning and looked outside. It was raining. June, what are you doing outside? You're getting wet. Looks like we're having a day inside today. Come on. Yeah. Closing the door. Woo! You got allergies. Well, I just got done looking at the home learning menu for this week and pretty pretty surprised what I saw because one of the tasks on there is a perfect rainy day activity. Build a fort. I never thought in a million years that a homework assignment from school would be to build a fort. So I'm pretty excited about that. I'm going to do that today. So here's my fort, pretty proud of it. Um, ended up using all the blankets in the house, but hey, it's a rainy day outside. You gotta make some sacrifices. I also put up these string lights that I found um, so I could have enough lighting in here to do my 30 minutes of reading, which I hope you're all doing still. And another task in our home learning menu this week is called Book Buzz. And, and the whole object is to recommend a book and to kind of convince someone to read a book. And the book that I want to recommend to all of you is The Boys Who Challenged Hitler by Philip Hoos. This book tells the incredible true story of a group of young teenage boys, not much older than all of you, who um, lived in Denmark during World War II. During World War II, Nazi Germany had taken over Denmark and there wasn't a lot that the citizens could have done, but these boys, they decided to act. And they pulled pranks on Nazi soldiers. They sabotaged a lot of their supply lines. And just a small group of them, there's a picture of them on the back, at such a young age, were actually able to create quite the stir that, um, that caused the Nazi army to take notice of them and and they actually saw them as a threat. And if you're looking for a book, it's a true story um, with a lot of bravery, a lot of crazy stories um, against a real powerful and scary villain, then this is a book for you. Um, if you can order it off online or um, whenever libraries open, check out The Boys Who Challenged Hitler. It's one of my favorite books. So. There we have it. Today, I did two learning tasks in one video. How about that? So, I hope you have fun creating your own forts. Take a picture or a video of your fort and post it on Seesaw. And then also, post a, post a, a book buzz, you know, and recommend a book to everybody on Seesaw. And you can put it on the blog too, so everybody can see it. Anyways, hope you all have a fantastic day. Um, and I'll have another video for you on Thursday. Okay, so have a good day. Bye